Hello everyone, it is uh, Callum here. Uh, I've decided uh, that you may notice a few things have changed on this channel. It is just called Bancroft now instead of Bancroft Reacts uh, because I decided that I want this channel to not just be me reacting to videos. I want this to be my channel. I want it to be my personal channel so this is just me now. So this is, this. I've got other channels, I've got my um production channel where I do voice acting and skits and shit, stuff like that. And uh, I have my gaming channel which is just nothing now, I'm not really fussed about doing anything with that. And then I've got subsequent other channels that are more personal projects that, well, I'm not going to talk about because I'd rather have people try and find them by themselves. This channel is just going to be more me now, it's just going to be me, it's my personal channel, this is just going to be me, it's, this channel is going to be just honest, it's just honestly me. One thing that I, I definitely will do is um, videos on playing ukulele, because I myself am a ukulele player. Uh, here's the fir my first ever ukulele, uh, it's a lovely, I it the wrong way. Love a little ukulele. Uh, I love it with all my heart. Uh, it's one of my favourites. Right on the back there, you probably can't see, but I have my initials there and just a little heart there. Just a little sign personalised there a bit. And recently, this past Christmas, which went very well for me, if anyone wants to know, I got my this banjo lele. Uh, from my loving mother, bless my mother's heart, uh, she got this banjole for me and I absolutely love it. It's a really nice... Uh, really cool. Uh, definitely going to be learning some George Formby songs for that. And recently I went into the town centre and I went into a little um, shop, uh, shop. It's a little independent shop that has a few... Nice little trinkets, odds and ends, maybe kind of like a place for um, craftsmen or people that have a craft, so crochet knitters, stuff like that to sell their stuff. And in there, uh, they had this very unique ukulele, which I've not ever seen, and I probably would never see another one of. And it's this, if that's... Give me a second, let me change the camera angle, because I just realised the lighting's really crap here. There we go, the lighting's much better for this. Look at that. Ain't this, ain't this something special? This is really something special. It's, um, oh, something's loose. Mm. I'm hearing something's loose in there, yeah. Things. One of the, because, uh, as I was saying, sorry for that little sidetrack, I just had to check something. With it. Basically, this is made out of an old ball that her father, the owner of the shop, her father had turned the ball, actually carved and turned this ball, and then turned it into a ukulele. Now, I will admit, if you listen, I haven't tuned it by the way, this is what this video is, is me tuning it, but it's not very loud, especially when against my chest, it's muted. That's because he has rigged it up to be electrical. That's a jack. And it seems the system he's using, by the looks of it, is a system where he has the jack and then he has pickups on the inside. One of the pickups has just come off, which isn't very good. So I'm wondering if there's a way I can just stick that back in there. Okay, I'll just stick that in there for now. Uh, it might be a case of, if I'm being honest, this was just, I just got this for the case of, it's very unique and I like the look of it. Uh, but if I'm being honest, I would not be surprised if it ends up turning out a dud where the jack just doesn't work. Or this whole setup doesn't work. But if I can get it working, it would be really fun. Be a nice little unique uke, but who knows. So that's just loose in there for now. So, so yeah, you can hear it jiggling about in there. While I'm here with Bear White, I'll also show off my uh, banjo lele. Try not to reflect the light into it like that. Ooh, you can see. Very nice. In the 
this case we have my regular uke in this case. Very beautiful. Yeah, got this from a, a shop in Coventry. I need to go down there some other time and have a look at their selection because this literally was the very first uke I ever got. I got this when I was just learning, so it would I would really want to go there again now that I've got a more keen eye to go and have a look. Because one thing I would like to do is get an electric uke so that I can get an amp and then I can, you know, not only get better sound quality so then I can possibly start recording my uke playing properly, but also possibly I can do some busking, which would be lots of fun. I also have a harmonica, which I also got for Christmas. Oh, goodness, it's starting to turn to a, oh, look at my shit, look at all my fancy shit. But no, I just thought I'd share with you some of my stuff that I do. I, I like playing music, but it's more of a hobby. Uh, here, let's see if you can hear this. I, can, I haven't learned to play anything on the harmonica yet, but here. I know the first bits of Happy Birthday, so... instrument to learn how to play to possibly go along with playing the uke you know any 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 other instrument you can learn you can play hands free to help enhance your uke playing is definitely something i suggest you do also please guys write in the comments below if you'd like to see um me playing any songs on my ukuleles i definitely would enjoy doing that because i do enjoy playing i do enjoy getting some practice it's a nice little chill it's a nice way for me to just kind of sit back, relax and chill in my rocking chair and just kind of relax a bit, do you know what I mean? So, anyway, very random video, just thought I'd show off my ukes and uh, talk about a little bit about my stuff and yeah, that's really it, really. So, a uh, <laughs> bit of a random video, don't know what the hell I'm going to call it, but who knows. Uh, first video of 2020, I just thought I'd, you know, do a quick little video, kind of just laying down, like, see this is the worst part, there's going to be a lot of jump cuts in this and things where I've had to cut out because like, when I'm just being me and I'm not being scripted or I'm not, I haven't got an idea of what I'm fully talking about, it gets really awkward because I start stumbling over my words and you start seeing how much of a very nervous kind of little fool I can be. <laughs> but no, uh, yeah, I just, I guess I just wanted this video to be kind of like a little update for anyone who's subscribed to this channel, like stuff will be coming to it. Uh, but it will not be coming at a consistent rate. I will try and make it as consistent as I can, but at this moment in time, uh, I'm getting things rolling on for 2020. I want this to be a more productive year. I want this to be a much more fun year. I'm going to try and be more productive and because uh, I finally got myself out of this rut that I was in so I want to try and just have a good time so yeah but yeah like I said up there on the channel like I said moving forward this is going to be I will still do reaction videos if you want me to like I said just comment down below on any of my videos or video you want me to react to and I shall but for now it is just going to be a case of of me uh, just doing whatever this is this channel is now just going to be me it's basically me my i don't want to say a personality channel and i don't want to 100 call it a vlog channel because i don't really like doing the whole ooh vlogging thing i i i must say i do think that youtube i enjoy the most are just people who turn the camera they sit down and they're just them do you know what i mean there's no high editing there's no there's, there's just no illusion of putting on a front, if you get what I mean, which is what I want to get away from. I don't want to, I don't want to be all smiles all the time. I want to be honest. I want to just kind of show that I'm, I am who I am. Also, please, comments on the uh, new facial hair. Uh, don't know if you can really see it in this kind of definition. But yeah, I've gone for kind of like a little chin strap, a thick chin strap, moustache and a little soul patch like that. Uh, hopefully you'll like it and if you don't, well it's too late because I've already, I've already done it and I like it myself so 
Oh well. But yeah, updates, facial hair, ukuleles. <laughs> Is that why I should just call it updates, <laughs> updates, ukuleles and facial hair? Oh well. But yeah, thank you anyone who watches this. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my randomness. And once more, uh, thank you everyone for watching this. I hope you're all safe, love, most all, happy always. This is Callum Bancroft saying good goodbye and I'll see you in the next video. Ta-ta.